Hey there, YouTube. Corn Cobb Piper coming at you. It is uh, Thursday, excuse me, afternoon. Hope everybody is having a great week so far. Uh, so for today's video, uh, for those of you who watched a couple of weeks ago, I decided I was going to make my own cigar leaf blend. And I'll post a link down below if you guys uh, want to check out that video as well. Um, it was just an English tobacco that I had that I just was not enthusiastic about. It was just to me a very, very average tobacco. And I had went up to uh, Tampa uh, recently to Ybor City, which is also known as Cigar City. And at one of the, uh, the places that I bought a couple of cigars from, uh, they actually, when they packaged the cigars in the bag, they, uh, they packaged them with some um, leftover uh, filler leaf. So I was told it was Nicaraguan and Honduran filler leaf. Uh, so I, I rehydrated that basically, chopped it up, and mixed 10% of uh, by volume into, into that English blend that I was just not a huge fan of. Uh, to see how it would taste and then uh, a little impromptu at the end I decided that uh, I'd let you guys help me name it and I did get some great submissions uh, for the names. It was actually very very hard for me to choose uh, but the name that I decided to go with was submitted by uh, Scott uh, Pellants and uh, his submission was Ye Old Stogie so I've changed that up a little bit. I've decided to name it Corn Cob Pipers Ye Old Stogie. Uh, but that's the name that I was going with. So thanks again, everybody that submitted all those great names. Uh, Scott, I'll go ahead and uh, send you a sample of this tobacco. I'm going to try it here in a minute. Hopefully it tastes good. Um, go ahead. I'll go ahead and include my uh, email address in the box below. Uh, just go ahead and email me your email address. And for those of you who haven't checked out uh, Scott's channel yet, he's new to the YTPC. I'll go ahead and uh, put the link to his channel down below. Definitely go check him out. Uh, check out his videos. Give him a sub. Uh, you know, welcome, welcome him to the, the YTPC. So without further ado, let's go ahead and uh, try this for the first time. I've packed it up into my Missouri Meerschaum uh, Country Gentleman. And uh, this has the uh, Vulcanite uh, freehand bit um, on it. So initially, I'm thinking there was a cigar leaf right there on top because I could definitely taste it. Still very, very much tastes like an English. Uh, I'm getting that, that woodiness from the Latakia. But I'm also, in the addition to that now, getting a bitter... Uh, spicy nuttiness um, from that cigar leaf. So I would say the addition of that cigar leaf has definitely improved on the uh, the overall taste of the tobacco. Thinking that it might be a little bit more creamy than it additionally was too. So my initial thoughts on this uh, tobacco, uh, Cigar Leaf def definitely added an improvement to it. I'll go ahead and pause the video now and work my way down, uh, you know, halfway through the bowl and we'll come back and I'll let you know uh, my final thoughts on it. So YouTube, I am back. I am now halfway through uh, this pipe. Um, I would say this is pretty decent. The, the, the cigar leaf definitely added some uh, extra tastiness, I guess, to this uh, bland English pipe tobacco. Am I a huge fan of it? Probably not. Um, would it be something that I would try to blend again? I don't think so. Uh, I definitely will finish the jar. Not afraid to send the sample off to Scott. Only difference that I'm really getting in taste wise is like I said, a, there's a, a, a bitterness, a nuttiness, and a, um, a spiciness that wasn't there initially in the English blend. So I definitely, this is about how much I got left. I'm guessing that's probably a couple ounces. 
definitely, uh, you know, finish it up. It's definitely worth smoking. And at some point, I might try my hand on, on making another cigar blend. Or, I, you know, I may just try to, you know, buy one from one of the smoking sites. So, once again, everyone, thanks for helping me name this. Uh, Corn Cob Pipers Ye Old Stogie Blend. Thank you, Scott, for submitting that idea. And as always, you do. Keep on piping.